Hello, it's Mella, and today's video is going to be a tour of my Bloxburg house because it's finally done, so I hope you enjoy. <laughs> so, as you can see here, this is my avatar, and someone just almost ran me over. And my house starts off, it's pretty simple, but... On the outside, there's a bunch of trees and stuff, some Christmas decorations, and the driveway, as well as a fence that kind of encloses the whole property. And I think it looks actually kind of cool from the outside, you know? The gate automatically opens, because, you know, I'm just rich. And this is the front of the house. I added some plants on top of the roof there, just to add a little, I don't know, uh, shebang, <laughs> I don't know. There's um, kind of a cottagey vibe to it, even though it's much bigger than a cottage. And I also wanted to make it two stories, so it's in a hole because I couldn't afford the multiple floors, so I got the basement instead. Here is the um, foyer, I guess. There's a little chandelier there that I forgot to color. Um, there's the stairs. It's not too fancy, but I kind of like it, you know? There's a little living room there where we would watch TV and such, along with a couple pictures, a couch. Um, there's still some Christmas decorations because when I was recording this, it was like a couple days before Christmas, so I haven't taken them all down yet. And I feel like this part of the house is very cozy. It's very small. I also did the first floor um, first, so I spent more time on it. This is the office, kinda, with my little premium a trophy there and a bookcase and stuff. Also, there's a bunch of pictures in this house that I didn't actually change. I just kind of copied them around. So I kind of forgot about that, sorry. Here's my garage, which I kind of like. Uh, there's my car. It's pretty basic, you know, as a garage. There's not really much that you need to add to it. There's a couple things that I wanted to have. This is my laundry room, which I really love. It's kind of different from the rest of the house because it's blue and yellow, where the rest of it, I feel, is more green. And there's a picture of Melanie Martinez because I love her. And as you can see here, I'm going back to the rest of the house. It's really taking me forever to open that door, isn't it? Over here is the kitchen, which is kind of basic, but I like it. It has everything you would need. And... As you can see here, I'm just turning. There's a couple shelves there, and through this door is my dining room, which I really love. This was the like one part of the house that when I started building it, I had like a perfect idea for what I wanted, and I think it turned out really cute. It's like a little plant room, sort of. I don't know. I like it. The roof is a little strange, but it's cool. And as you can see here through this glass door, it goes to my backyard. I have a little outdoor space heater, um, which kind of looks like a mushroom to me. I don't know why, I like the shape. Over here is my patio, which kind of looks like a pergola a little bit. There's some lights and stuff. And if you look close, there are actually some Halloween decorations on the table that I forgot to take down. There's a little sled over there. I forgot to color that, sorry about that. And here's my garden, which I think is very cute, very cottage core kind of thing. It's pretty small and there's not really much to it and I keep forgetting to water the plants so they just occasionally die off and I have to replace them. But it's, it's cute, you know? Especially with the arch there on top of the gate, which I didn't know that was a thing you could do in Bloxburg until I actually did that. So kind of proud of it. Going back inside the house now, you can see I'm just closing my door. Also, most of this um, footage is slowed down a little bit because I realized I was moving pretty fast. So it's a little bit slow in some parts too, and I just realized that. Up here is my jukebox and a little, another kind of chill room. There's not really much in it, just like a bookcase, a TV, some more paintings I never changed. Over here is the, I wanna say hallway, but it's also just like a room that leads to other rooms. It's not really a hallway. Here is my sister's room, which is very purple, and I made it for her a while ago, but she can't really play Bloxburg anymore because her phone's a bit old. It doesn't really work, but if she ever does play, you know, here's her room, because I think, and I think it's very cute. I really did have trouble saying that sentence there. Sorry about that. 
going back into the hallway, over here is my room, and I left the bathroom door open, sorry about that. And going into my room, there's not really much. It's kind of a little bit messy, kind of doesn't really have one specific theme to it, just a bunch of random stuff I placed in that I was like, eh, sure, I'd put this in my room. But I think it actually looks pretty cute, you know? There's my little um, octopus plushie there, and just a bunch of random stuff, really. Once again, me having trouble going through a door. Just, mm, I don't know. <laughs> Here's the bathroom, which was the last thing that I finished, and also I'm kind of proud of it. I think it's very cute. Um, there's not really much to it, other than a sink, a toilet, and a shower, but really, what else would you need? I mean, what else would you need? I don't actually know, I feel like I forgot something. But I'm not sure what it would be. I have my walk-in shower, which I didn't actually walk in, but there is in fact a shower head there. Then over here, going to my balcony, which has a little hammock and a bunch of plants. It has a very nice view over the rest of my backyard. Only thing is, if you're in first person and you sit in it, you kind of can't really see anything. <laughs> you just kind of glitch into the hammock. It it's kind of funny, but I was trying to show that the roof of the balcony is glass and it has like some nice... Um, fairy lights around it, so I think that's pretty cute. And going back to the inside of the house, there's not really much else to show. I mean, that's about it, really. And, you know, uh, just a quick thing. If you are watching this, make sure to um, comment any suggestions that you have. I've kind of run out of video ideas. Uh, don't forget to like and comment as well, you know, just comment anything really, and I'll probably like it, unless it's annoying, in which case I'll remove it, so. Uh, there's not really much else to my house, I have a bunch of trees and stuff, um, I think it looks kind of cute, I really hope you all like it too. And you know, um, it took me a really long time to make this house, and there are still a few things that I would go back and change probably. Because I changed my mind about a thousand times. Everything on this plot has been recolored about a hundred times. But it turned out well. And I really hope you all ag agree as well. Anyway, if you're watching to the end, I thank you. And I really hope you enjoy. Um, have a great day. Um, don't forget to subscribe or whatever other things that YouTubers usually say in their intros. I'm not really sure. Anyway, um, have a great day. Goodbye. Thank you.